This is a tileable brick pattern. It's similar to a seamless 3D texture, but physical. They are good for large areas where brilliant detail is needed. They connect together and can be cut to fit around features like windows and doors. They give more uniform and consistency over other methods like brick rollers and stamps. But they're quite brittle, so they can break easily because they're quite thin. Here we have the silicone mould. This one can make 15 tiles in one go. But it's quite modular and can make as little as 3 tiles or as many as you'd like with as little as 4 3D printed parts. It's quite easy to use. All you do is mix your resin, pour it all over the mould and use a flat scraper to push the resin into all the tiles and make sure it's fairly uniform, not too thick, not too thin. When it's set, you can remove the silicone by tipping the mould and pick out the tiles. The frame keeps the silicone quite rigid and flat. It's also used in reverse to make silicone moulds. This is called a master. It's one of the four 3D printed parts that come in this kit. It's a panel that has three brick tiles and it slides into the silicone frame. It has a female side that looks like a V-shaped groove on one side and it has a male V-shaped groove on the other side. These masters slide into the frame to form a base on which to pour silicone. The grooves seal the parts allowing silicone to be poured in without leaking. So there's four basic parts. Two end frames, a middle frame and a master. To make a bigger mould all you would do is make more middle frames and masters. Then keep sliding and bolting them in place. Once the silicone is set you would remove the master parts to leave only the silicone and outer frame. This is a complete sustainable moulding system. The silicone mould will degrade over time and will need to be replaced, so being able to remould this easily is essential. These parts can be downloaded for free from Thingiverse. The link is in the description, and if you have any comments, I'd appreciate them. If you like this video, then scrunch that like button and subscribe to get notifications of any new videos. Thanks for watching.